the scientists all over the world are investing lots of money and resources on the study of how human life can be increased but till now they can't find any such technology on the other side we find some immortal characters in hindu mythology according to hindu mythology all these immortals are believed to remain alive till the end of kaliyuga all these immortals represent various qualities of humanity their purpose is to guide the kalki avatara the last incarnation of lord vishnu ashwatthama he played a crucial role in mahabharata he was the only one who is responsible to change the end of mahabharata he was the son of guru dronacharya and kripi he fought with his father in the battle of mahabharata from the side of korvas against the pandavas he was the final commander in chief of the korvas raja bali he was a gracious asura king in hindu mythology he was grandson of bhakt pradhada he is known for his charity religiousness righteous attitude toward all it is believed that bali arrive on earth once every year on the auspicious occasion of onam festival ved vyasa he is the rishi who divides the vedas into four parts he is the main and important character in hindu mythology according to hindu beliefs vyasa is avatar of lord vishnu hanuman he is the true devotee of lord rama he is the son of anjana and monkey king kesari and he is also known as son of wind god pavan he is one of the major character in hindu epic ramayana and its several versions as one of the immortal he is also known as an incarnation of lord shiva vibhishana he was king of lanka in the legendary epic ramayana he was a rakshasa younger brother of rakshasa king ravana he advised ravana who kidnapped sita to give her back to her husband rama with full respect and honor but ravana doesn't listen to him then vibhishana joined rama's side later on when rama killed ravana vibhishana was crowned as king of lanka kripacharya he plays an important role in mahabharata kripa becomes an acharya guru or teacher of the royal children which gave him the name kripacharya in mahabharata he was fighting on korva's side against the pandavas in kali yuga he is believed to be most superior among all the rishis parshurama he is a son of renuka and one of the saptrishi jamadangi he is one of the immortal of hinduism he is considered to be the sixth avatar of lord vishnu in hinduism his weapon is axe he got his famous axe after pleasing lord shiva according to hindu mythology parshurama successfully conquered the whole world all alone he was also the teacher of mahabali karna if you like this video then please like comment share and also subscribe our channel